Hello guys, good evening, welcome back, good to see you. Let me know if you can listen to me, no sé si me pueden escuchar. Ok, let me know please, si estamos bien con el sonido. Yes, hello, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Hello teacher. Hello Guadalupe. It's strong and clear. Ok, thank you, thank you Arabella. <laughs> ok, hello Astrid, Danilo and Cesar, thank you so much for being here. Hello teacher. Hello Astrid, good to see you. Teacher, uh, uh, this, uh, uh, this day and the uh, conversing with you. Oh, with you, yes, I think with you we're going to have the meeting, yeah. I had the problem. Ok, tell, ok, what happened? I, I, I walk in, no, um, only stay in the first, uh, first part of the class. Ok, 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 I got it. Um, maybe what you can do is to write a message to the Insafor because they are going to count the minutes you are in the class. Ok, Astrid. Ok, eh, si puede, maybe you can write. You can write ah, okay. to Insafor, to Insafor, to inform them. Para informar, to inform them that you are not going to be like, uh, because you have to work or something. Porque ellos cuentan los minutos, they count the minutes you are in the meeting. Ah, okay. ok, Astrid, only that. And I hope you are ok. Ok, guys, let's start. And uh, I'm going to start with the attendance, right? Voy a empezar con la asistencia. Espero haya tenido una muy buena semana. Estamos en la día 15, lección 15. And uh, ya casi, right? It's almost. We are almost in at the end. No olviden que el lunes no vamos a tener clase, okay? Don't forget Monday. We're not going to have classes until Tuesday, hasta el martes. Okay. Okay, let's go with the attendance. Arabella is here. Arabella. Arabella. Present. Present. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's see Astrid Guadalupe. Astrid. Present teacher. Okay, Present thank you. Teacher. Thank you. Cesar Armando. Cesar Armando. Present teacher. Solo que voy manejando, regreso acá. Solo okay. Okay, Cesar. Okay, thank you. Let's see, and uh, Cynthia de Jesus is not longer here. Daniel Alexander, Daniel Alexander, Daniel Alexander. No, okay, no, it's not here. Daniel Ernesto. Present. Okay, thank you, Gladys Jamilet. Gladys Jamilet. Gladys, no. Guadalupe del Carmen, Guadalupe. Guadalupe del Carmen is here, me pareció verla. Guadalupe, sí, Juárez. Dicha soy yo. Ok, ok, aquí está Guadalupe. Thank you. Carla Lisset is here. Carla Lisset, Carla Lisset. Carla Lisset, no. Eh, Catherine Merali. Catherine Merali. ¿Dónde está Catherine? Catherine. Ok, let's see. Luz de María. Luz de María. Luz de María. No. Eh, Manuel de Jesús Flores. Manuel de Jesús. Ok, man. Is that here? Meredith Janet. Meredith Janet. Meredith, no yet. And Oscar Antonio. Oscar Antonio. Oscar, no. And uh, Reina Guadalupe. Reina Guadalupe. No. Ok. Eh, Sandra Elizabeth, creo que ya no está. And uh, Santos Maribel, yes, I see you Present. there. Ok, thank you. Silvia Betzabel, Silvia Betzabel. Silvia Betzabel. No está Silvia. Ok, guys, thank you. Ok, thank you so much, guys, to you that are punctual. Let me ask you something. Vamos a empezar con una dinámica diferente. We're going to start with a warm up, right? Necesito que me digan, I want you to tell me why you are learning English, why you are here, and uh, what do you want to accomplish with English? Okay, let me just specify questions. Okay. 
why do you want to learn English? Esta es la primera, that is the first one. And uh, why, why, let's just, what do you want? What do you, hello, what do you want to accomplish in the future? In the future, que es lo que queremos alcanzar, right? En el futuro. Why do you want to learn English? Yes, why do you want to learn English? Por ejemplo, let's say, um, I am I still learning. Yo todavía sigo aprendiendo inglés. Esto nunca nos detenemos, right? Podemos responder, I want to learn English because I... One, for example, I want to travel to another country. Esa puede ser una razón, country. Yes. Yes, mm -hmm. yes right. Uh, ¿Qué quiero alcanzar? What do I want to accomplish? ¿Qué quiero alcanzar? I want okay. to get, por ejemplo, a better, mejor, better job. A better job. Sure. También, I want to, I want to get more time. More I want time. to spend more time with my family, right? A veces el inglés nos da esa, esa facilidad de trabajar desde casa. I want to spend time with my family. Okay, what do you want, guys? Tell me. Me gustaría saber qué esperamos. Why do you want to learn English? Voy a empezar, I'm going to start with, uh, let's see, Astrid, I'm going to start with you, porque no va a estar usted, okay. well, I'm going to take advantage of you. Okay, Astrid, tell me, vamos a escuchar a Astrid, let's listen Astrid, okay, Astrid, go ahead. Why do you want to learn English? Um, I want to learn English uh, because... I, I want to um, conversation with the other person okay. in the United States. Okay. You want to travel? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, um, in, in, uh, it's necessary in, in, me, in, my, in, my, in my work. Mm -hmm. Because it's the, the email. In? I'm sorry? The, the email. The email. In. Oh, the, the email. The email. email. The email. email. Mm -hmm. The email uh, with the, the partner. Oh, email with your partners. Okay. And Very, mm -hmm. I necessary for my, uh, my, my daughter. Your daughter. My, my daughter. Yes. It is necessary. Motivate. Motivate. Motivate uh, my daughter to learn English. Okay, perfect. Me encantó. I love the last one. Motivate my daughter. Yes, right. Exactly. And uh, what do you want to accomplish in the future? ¿Qué es lo que quiere alcanzar in the future with English, maybe? Or maybe with your work. Uh, I read the book in, in English. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, I the, the um, understand the movie. Oh, I want to understand movies. In the conversation with the other person. Ah, okay, and to have conversations, right? Okay, very good, Astrid. Okay, thank you, Astrid. Okay, let's listen another opinion. What about you, uh, Danilo, what about you? Why do you want to learn English? Tell me. Um, because I want to live in the USA. Uh, mm -hmm. um, that it's necessary. Mm -hmm. okay. And what, what do you want to accomplish in the future? I want to be a preacher for young people, oh, okay. um, mm -hmm. Spanish or English. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, oh. Yeah, I want to understand all music in English. Okay, to understand, right? To understand 
understand English music. English music. También mencionó Danilo that he wants to be, be a preacher, right? Yes, be a preacher. Okay, son okay. muy buenos goals, right? Okay, very good. Thank you, Danilo. Let's see, uh, what about you, Guadalupe? Why do you want to learn English? Because I uh, speak, speak English. Oh, I want to speak English, right? To have another language. To have another language, right? Para tener otro idioma que es important, right? ¿Y qué queremos alcanzar? What do you want to accomplish in the future, Guadalupe? Mm. Mm. I want to get a better, better job. Better job, yes, right? I want to get a better job, yes. Definitivamente el inglés nos puede dar that opportunity. Okay, thank you, Guadalupe. What about you, Manuel? Why do you want to learn English? Tell me. Um, I want to I want to speak English for I need visit the United States. Uh, and the other answer mm -hmm. uh, I need I need to learn English for I need the better other works mm -hmm. in, in another country. Yes, for right. Example, and then uh, I want to visit, for example, England. Mm -hmm. It's a beautiful country. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, yes, definitely right. Más que todo, to communicate, right? To communicate yeah. with others. Imagínense si van a un país donde solo hablan inglés. And uh, you said, mm, a veces pasa esto, mm. And then, uh, and then, so, we, we just say that, okay, I want. Usted ya puede entablar una conversación, right? Yes, Manuel? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. It is important. It is important. Ahora ustedes ya son capaces de, eh, por lo menos, comunicarse de una forma básica. Más adelante ustedes ya van a tener la capacidad para poderse comunicar de forma, ya de entablar una conversación, un debate, etc. Okay, what about you, Maribel? Tell us, please. Share with us, why do you want to learn English? Um, I want to learn English to know a second language and help my children with their English homework. Mm, okay, to help. My children, okay, very good. And, and what are your goals? Your, what do you want to accomplish? Es lo que queremos alcanzar in the future. Mm, I want to speak English um, fluido, no sé cómo se dice. Fluently, fluently. Fluently. Fluently, yeah. Um, understand conversations and Movies, music. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, right. Yes, that, that is our goal, right? To understand music. Not, not solo música, not only music, but also native speakers. También a los native speakers, right? Okay, very good. Thank you, Maribel. What about you, Meredith? Tell us, why do you want to learn English? Mm -hmm. Hi, teacher. Hello. Mm -hmm. uh, I learn English because a conversation to have conversation with my family in, mm. in, in, in the USA. USA. <laughs> yes. USA to have to communicate right with my family. Yes in to my job and to have a job right yes to have a better job okay that's good thank yes. you 
Okay, what about... In, uh -huh. oh, okay, I'm sorry. Continue, continue. Uh, oh. No, no, no. Continue, Meren. Continue. Okay. Eh, how do you say? Espero. Espero? Uh -huh. I want or I hope. Uh, um, I want? I want... I want to... Eh, converse, eh, eh, listen, listen to movies in English, mm -hmm. eh, music, eh, because I like the music in English. You like the English music, English music. Eh, eh, comprender. To understand, yes, to understand. Mm -hmm. I understand. To understand? Mm -hmm. I understand mm -hmm. the book. The books? In English. In English, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, just that. Done, just that. Okay, very good, Melanie. To understand, to communicate, to have a better job to write. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay, thank you. What about... You, no sé si le pregunté a usted, Arabella. What about you, Arabella? Why do you want to learn English? Uh, I want to uh, I learn English mm -hmm. uh, to uh, understand movies. Mm -hmm. And get a better show. Mm -hmm. And uh, and keep conversation mm -hmm. with with people. With people, yes. yes. To have yes. conversation with others. Exactly right. Okay. okay. Thank you, Arabella. What about you, Carla? What about you, Carla? Why do you want to learn English? Hola, hola, Carla. Ok. César creo que todo eso lo mejor que iba a ir escuchando. If I'm not wrong, right? Ok, ya estamos bien. ¿Por qué les hago esta pregunta, guys? Porque a veces, ah, decimos, vengo de trabajar, no quiero, no quiero conectarme, tengo, hice tantas cosas. Pero recordemos que el inglés, el inglés es cuestión de práctica. Si no lo practicamos, lo podemos olvidar y eso ya nos atrasaría un poquito en el proceso de aprender el idioma. Así es. Recordemos que no es solo las dos horas que estamos aquí, es lo que usted hace durante el día para mejorar el inglés. Así que los invito que durante el día usted puede escuchar ya sea la radio en inglés, puede descargar, hay una aplicación donde usted puede descargar la radio y ahí le van a aparecer muchas emisoras. Otra forma de, de practicar es viendo videos, right, in English. Si usted tiene niños, puede ver las caricaturas en inglés. Eso es algo que también les va a ayudar bastante. Ok, entonces, para nos desviemos de nuestro objetivo, right, that it is that you speak English. Okay, let's go over the lesson. Vámonos entonces to the lesson. Remember that yesterday we had a homework, right? Recordemos que el día de ayer tuvimos una tarea. Okay. Así que este día la vamos a hacer. Today we're going to do the homework. You're going to present it. Pero antes vamos a hacer un review de las prepositions que estuvimos estudiando ayer. Ok, voy a empezar con Manuel. Manuel, imagine that I didn't come yesterday. No, no vine ayer a la clase. I didn't come yesterday. What did you study? Me va a recordar. What did you study, Manuel? Can you tell me, please? Yes. Uh, we, we are the study. Hmm? Uh, where is your bed? Uh, for example, on the... Uh, mm -hmm. uh, ¿Cómo se dice? La dirección, teacher. The, the address. The address. The address. Mm -hmm. the address. Mm -hmm. uh, I go to the. I go to the park. I go to the city bank. Mm -hmm. The. the uh, 
I go to the shoes, mm. Davis, Davis, drugs, uh, mm -hmm. for example, uh, the, the other streaks. Mm -hmm. um, uh, y... Quiero ver. Mm -hmm. Ah, solo eso me acuerdo, teacher. <risa> ok, ok, very good. Ya, ya me dio una idea de lo que estudiamos ayer. Ok, guys, let's make a review. Vamos a hacer entonces un review. Vámonos entonces, let's go to the WhatsApp. Vamos a hacer a game for you to practice the prepositions that we studied yesterday. Ok, let me know if uh, you are in WhatsApp. And uh, let's see. Ok, just... See here if I can share a link. Oh, yeah. Let's see this. Okay. Veamos qué pasa acá. Okay. Give me just. Okay. Give me just a second, please. Okay. Parece que está en el internet. Okay. Let me just. Teacher, ¿y eso que aparece en MP3? Ok, guys, sorry. I, I was checking the internet. Parece que hay como mala conexión por acá. Ok, here it is. Ok. So let's go to the WhatsApp group and I'm going to share a link. And uh, the, the same process, right? You go there, enter your name. That's it. Let's go to the game. Vamos entonces to the game. Se los comparto también en el Zoom. I'm going to share it through Zoom. Está también. So you can go there. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Yes. Pero aquí dice iniciar una prueba en vivo, asignar tarea. ¿Qué le damos ahí, teacher? Oh, no, no, perdón. El último enlace, el último enlace. ¿Eso no? No, ese no. El último enlace. No, los jueguitos otra vez. <ríe> yes, right. Ok, let's see who is in the... No veo a muchos, right? I'm still waiting okay. for participants. Okay, Meredith, I see you in the game. Yes. Yes. Okay. Mm. Astrid, too. There it is. Okay, Maribel, it's there, too. Yo estoy dentro acá, pero le doy a empezar. Oh. No, no, no. You have to go to the second link. Link. You have to use the second one. Okay, the second one, Danilo. See the last, the last link. Yes. Uh huh. Please. Mm, did, can you write your name? Uh, teacher. Teacher. Mm -hmm. yo. A ver, Meredith, no, no Guadalupe, no yet. De allí, ¿a dónde le doy a empezar, teacher? Hey, oh, you can click there. Sorry, okay, ahí está Carla. Guadalupe, sí, tenemos que presionar empezar. Okay, Danilo, I see you there. Yes. Let's see. Okay, how many, what about Meredith, Astrid, Maribel? Okay. Let's see, Manuel, you are not yes. in the game, Manuel. What happened? Are you afraid of girls? Oh, Let's there go. you are. There you are. <laughs> yes, no. yes, you are there. I see you. Arabella is missing. Arabella, what happened? Arabella. I go well, okay, I okay. Go. Cesar no podría, ¿verdad? Carla is. Okay. So, ready? Solo vamos a esperar un ratito a Arabella. En Guadalupe, you are there too. 
Okay. Ready, Arabella? Oh, yes. Sí. There you are. Yes. Let's go, guys. Recordemos el último. We have a penalty, right? ¿Dónde le vamos a dar, teacher? Ahorita. Vamos a empezarlo ya. Okay, let's go. My flight is long to live.
I lose. The last okay, let's see. Hi, teacher. Hello. Yeah. Finish. Okay, let's see who got the first place. But it's okay Meredith. Okay, Meredith, congratulations. Then the teacher. second place. Maribel. The third place, Danilo. Manuel in fifth place. ¿Qué pasó, Manuel? What happened? And Astrid, what happened, Astrid? ¿Qué pasó, Astrid? What happened? The last one sinks, teacher. <laughs> oh, yes, the last one. Are, you are correct, okay. You are right. Okay. <laughs> Astrid. We're going to listen Astrid voice. Vamos a escuchar okay. la voz de Astrid. <laughs> Difficult. The, Difficult. The, the, the hours in the address. Yes. Ana Gabriel. Sí. Ana Gabriel. <laughs> Por Paquita, la del barrio. Por Paquita, la del barrio. La del animal de cinco patas, ¿verdad? <laughs> <laughs> Ok, ok, vamos a esperar entonces al final de la clase, tal vez nos pueda. She can delight us, right? With her voice. Ok, so let's continue with the lesson, right? Remember, we have the speaking task, tenemos la speaking task. So remember, they must be six questions and uh, six answers, right? So who is ready to present? ¿Quién está listo para presentar? Who is ready? Okay, if not, I'm gonna choose. Si no, yo empiezo, teacher, I'm gonna choose, right? Yes. Teacher, uh, how the, the last present? Oh, you, did you present? Oh, you presented, Astrid? The last, the last, the last class? Mm, the last class, okay, you presented. Yes. Okay, you said present all. Let's see, uh, Danilo, did you present yesterday? No. Okay, who is your partner? I, I don't remember. Okay, let me see. With me, Maribel. Okay, let's go. Solo que ya no recuerdo dónde tengo la tarea. Okay, let's go. Okay. Maribel, ¿es? Sí. Where is your cell phone? It's in my office. And it's next to my... Notebook. Okay. One and one or, or todo, teacher? Oh, you can, you can interact. Pregunto. Yes. Danilo, where is your car? It's in, it is in the hallway. It's on the table. Me dijo computer o car? Car. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. It's in the parking. It's between the mo motorcycle and the BC. Okay. okay. Hello. Hola. Uh, Maribel. Sí. Where is Japan? Uh, my pan is in my bedroom okay. it's in the closet okay closet. danilo where are your your shoes shoes i don't have shoes <laughs> uh, in the my my shoes in the shop, it's under the table. I buy the, the shoes, teacher. Okay. Okay. 
Ok. Uh, Maribel, where is your sister? Hi, my sister is in the uh, living room. Uh, ne, on, she is on sofa, <laughs> the sofa. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> um, Danilo, uh, where is your refrigeration? <laughs> Hello. Me escucha, Danilo? Yes. Hola. Where is your refrigeration? O refrigerator, perdón. It's in the kitchen. Kitchen. Uh, next to the... Cocina. Next to the kitchen. Kitchen. Eh, pero cocina... Oven. Me confundí. Oven. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, I, that's all. That's all. Okay. Just remember some things, guys. For example, Maribel le preguntó, what, where are? Where are your shoes, right? Where are your shoes? Y escuché que le respondió, it's eh, in the shop, algo así creo que dijo. In the shop. Recordemos que como es una palabra en plural, debemos de respetar, right? They, they are. are. Yes, they are. They are. Mm -hmm. Ok, basically that. Ok, Manivel, congratulations. Solo en refrigerator, right? Sí, sí. Refrigerator, ok. Ok, that's it. Okay. okay, let's continue. The next group, who is ready? Who is going to yes. present? Arabella. Yes. Okay, Arabella. Arabella? Mm -hmm. You are ready. Oh. Okay. You are ready. Yes. Are you ready, I'm Arabella? Ready. I'm ready. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go. Where is your bed? Uh, my bed is in in Living the bedroom. The bed. Okay. Uh, where is the coffee maker? I uh, my coffee maker is in the kitchen. Another uh, question. Uh, where is the computer? My computer you... is. No, no, no. no. Uh, no. Uh, again, where is your computer? Where is uh -huh. my computer? Is in the office. Okay. Um, the other, uh, the other question, where is your, where is your sofa? My sofa is in the living room. Okay. Where is your clothes? Uh, my clothes. It is. It, are, my clothes are it is. in the closet. In the bathroom. Yes, yes. Closet. closet is in the bedroom. Mm -hmm. Okay. Only, verdad? Teacher. Mm -hmm. 
¿Cuántas eran? ¿Cinco o seis? Ok, it's ok, five. Did you finish? ¿Ya terminamos? Yes. 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 <laughs> ok, ok. <laughs> ok, just something. Creo que lo escuché a usted, Manuel, que dijo. Um, where, where is your clothes, right? Where is your clothes? Yes. Okay. Esta palabra es en plural, entonces debemos de utilizar el. R. R. Okay. Ah, Where are your clothes, it. right? They are, etc. In the clothes, in the closet. Right? Okay, vamos a entonces a detenernos hasta aquí. Luego voy a continuar con los demás grupos, right? And uh, vamos a continuar with the lesson. Okay, let's move on. But recordemos las prepositions, right? Ayer vimos las prepositions of time. Vimos las preposiciones de tiempo que eran in... On, on, at, at ¿verdad? Esas son las que vimos el día de ayer. También vimos las prepositions of place. Son las que nos indican el lugar. Y solo para recordar, right? Just for you to remember, remind. Tenemos in, adentro, right? In front of, en frente de, behind or behind. Tenemos on, next to, and under. Ok, eso es lo que vimos el día de ayer, right? Vamos a practicar this date. Ok, uh, let's start with you, Astrid. Uh, where is the cell phone? Where is the cell phone? Tell me. Where is the cell phone? Yes, Astrid. The cell phone is near the brush. Yes, near the brush or next to, right? And next next two. Both, okay? Very good. Okay, let's see the next one. Meredith, number three. Where is the map? Where is the map? Hmm? Where is the map? It's the map. Mm -hmm. Is mm -hmm. under. Is under? El que? The newspaper. It's Very under the newspaper. Oh. Very good. Okay, Guadalupe Juarez, number four. What is the chair? What is the chair? The chair is in the table. The chair is... Mm, or alguna otra forma? Está detrás? O decimos detrás? Is, okay. Ajá, uh, sería... The desk. Next, next is... To también, también. Next to... Chair. Next to... The... The table. Está aquí. O también la que está bastante cerca. Behind the table, right? Behind the table. Okay. The under the table. Under. La cuestión es que tiene que estar como completamente right. Pero tiene la parte de está acá. Pero it's acceptable too. Can be. It can be. It's an option. Vamos a ver que está en el teléfono. Ok, let's see. Eh, no sé si está Carla. Carla, where is the wallet, Carla? Where is the wallet? Where is the wallet? Wallet is mm -hmm. el... The wallet? Mm -hmm. On top. Mm -hmm. Wallet is... Cartera. Cartera. Y podría ser my wallet o table. Mm, the wallet is, según la imagen. Espérame yes. que no puedo ver la imagen. Déjame ver. Mm -hmm. Ok. Ok. Up. Up. Is where? It's the wallet. Yes. On top of. También. Or on. Notebook. The notebook. Yes, it's um, the notebook. Hi. Okay, what about the sunglasses? Where are the sunglasses, Maribel? Where are the sunglasses? The sunglasses are in front of the bag. Is in, oh, they are right, in front of the bag. Ok, let's practice some questions. Vamos a practicar some questions, right? 
Ok. Si, por ejemplo, si yo quiero una yes, no questions. Are the sunglasses, are the sunglasses on the book, digamos? Are the sunglasses on the book? ¿Cómo puedo responder esto? How can I answer this? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. O, oh, the other oh, way. Don't... No. no. They aren't. No, they aren't. They aren't. Okay. What about this one? Is... Is your cell phone is your cell phone next to next to the back? How can I answer this? How can I answer this? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Muy bien. Very good. Yes, it is. Oh, the other one. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Okay. No, it isn't. Okay, where, let's practice. Where is your book? What is your book? ¿Dónde está su libro? What is your book? It is in my bag. It is mm -hmm. in my bag. Very good. And what about where are your markers? What are your markers? Yes, they are on the table. They are marked. Yes, they are on the table. Okay. Bien. Estas son las dos preguntas, right? Aquí solo queremos saber un yes o un no. Y en la siguiente, una respuesta más específica, right? Más larga. Okay, let's practice with the exercise we have here. Okay, let's see. Uh, Meredith. Are the books on the chair? Meredith, are the books on the chair? Mm, no. No, it's... No, are the books is. on the chair? No. Are, no, aren't. Mm -mm. Oh. Mm. Sería no. They no, aren't. They aren't. They aren't. They aren't. They are. ¿Dónde es que están? They are. It's they are. In, in the. No. In the book bag. Book bag. Okay. Very good. Let's continue. Arabella. Hello, Arabella. Let's continue. Está ahí, Arabella. Yes, yes. Okay, let's practice this one. Is the cell phone behind the brush? No. 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 It isn't, right? It is no, it isn't. Mm -hmm. The cell phone is uh, uh, next the brush. Next to the brush, right? Next to the brush. Next to the brush. Okay, next very good. Brush. Okay, let's continue with you, Danilo. Is the map in front of the glasses? Is the map in front of the glasses, Danilo? No, is isn't. Mm -hmm. It isn't. Mm -hmm. Where is it? It isn't. Where is it? The map is behind to other map. Behind? Behind the map. Behind the, the map. Behind the, map. behind the map. Ok, excelente. No sé si hay dudas, tenemos estos dos tipos de questions, right? Uno donde solo queremos saber un sí o un no, y la otra donde damos la, el, la, el, la posición, right, of the object. Ok, no questions. Uh -huh. Ok, good guys, let's continue. Let's continue with more exercise. Vamos a hacer, we're going to listen this part. Uh, you're going to match, right? Vamos a escuchar the audio file. Y luego ustedes me van a ayudar with the, 
with information. Where are Kate's things? Match the things with their location. Okay, let's listen. Page 12, exercise 10. Listening. Kate's things. Listen. Where are Kate's things? Match the things with their locations. Where are my earrings? Are they on the table? No. Oh, here they are, in my purse. Now, where's my watch? Hmm, it's not in my purse. Where? There it is, in front of the television. Oh, of course. Thanks, Joe. Let's see. My sunglasses, where are they? Next to my watch? No. Are they behind your purse? No, they aren't. Oh, they're on the chair. Great. Now I just need one more thing. My camera. Maybe it's on the table. No, it's not. It's under the table. Okay, let's do it, guys. What about the watch? What is the watch? B. B. In front of the television. Yes. What about the sunglasses? On the chair. On the chair. They are on the chair. What about the camera? Under the table. Yes. Excellent. Imagínense con una vez, right? We are good, guys. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue with more. Remember, today we are just practicing, right? Okay, let's describe the picture, right? Vamos a describir the picture together. Okay, por ejemplo, where is the briefcase? Usted me va a describir these parts, right? Um, I will ask you. Okay, let's see, Manuel. Are you there, Manuel? Está ahí, Manuel. Yes, yes. Okay, okay, tell me, Manuel, let's describe the picture. Quiero que usted me describa la picture, right? Cinco oraciones. Five sentences. Tell me. The picture. Yes, the picture. Can you see the picture? No sé si puede ver the picture. The cat. Mm -hmm. Tenemos. Exactly. Ahí escucha a alguien, Arabella. No escucha nada. Ok, ok. Vamos a escuchar a Arabella y luego usted me ayuda con otras descripciones. Okay, Arabella, let's start, please. Ok. The mm -hmm. cat on the sofa. The cat is on the sofa. Ok. okay Continue. The cat is on the sofa. Mm -hmm. the, the umbrella under, no, no, eh, como es behind the sofa. Mm -hmm. Ok. Eh, the chair mm -hmm. eh, next to the, the television. Mm -hmm. eh, the television from, from the sofa. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. eh, the wife next to the husband. Ok, Arabella, perfect. Solo algo bien importante, Arabella, es que eh, respetemos, por ejemplo, los verbos. Usted escuché que me dijo, the woman next to, next to the husband, ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces acá nos hace falta el verbo. The woman is next to. No nos olvidemos del verbo ah, porque okay. si no está mal, ¿ok? En español lo podemos decir, ok, the woman next to, ¿verdad? Y nosotros lo entendemos. Uh -huh. Pero en inglés siempre hay un, un orden, right? El sujeto, el verbo y luego lo que sigue de la oración. Ok. okay. Pero Thank muy you. bien. Ok. Thank you. Ok, Manuel, are you ready, Manuel? Yes, I'm okay. ready. Now, describe, please. No use uh, los mismos que utilizó Arabella. Uh... Uh -huh. I see the the cat. I see the umbrella. Okay, but where uh, are they? Where are they? You have to give me specific locations. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It's on the 
it's on the it's a TV. Mm -hmm. Ok, los demás, por favor, en el chat box, escribamos cinco oraciones acerca de la picture, right? Utilizando el location, así como lo hizo Arabella. Ok, Manuel, let's continue. Uh -huh, the TV, what? Where is the TV? Uh, the TV. Mm -hmm. uh, uh -huh. <laughs> y el champán, pues. <laughs> Hay que me darle la cabeza, teacher. Okay, let's try, let's try. For example, the TV. ¿Dónde está el TV? The TV. ¿En qué, en qué lugar está el TV? Está atrás, está a la par. Where is that? Uh, está. The TV is. Uh -huh. Is next to the table. Next to next. the table. Okay, sure. there you have. Ya tenemos una, sigamos, continue. Borró la cosa, espérame. No sé qué es lo que dice el teléfono, no puedo ver la, la, la imagen. No puedo ver la imagen, ok. Ya, yeah, ok, ok, baje, continue. Uh, the cat, uh -huh. the cat uh -huh. is... Is, uh, como se dice, mm -hmm. it's is, okay, sofa. The cat. Is sofa. The cat is, it's a sofa. Okay, vamos a escribir eso. The cat is, is a sofa. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. El gato está un sofá. ¿Qué le hace que le haga falta ahí? In. In. In es adentro. ¿Dentro del sofá? Dentro. Mm -hmm. No, on. on. On, right? On, on the sofa. Oh, I had a sofa. Okay, continue. Uh, Cinco oraciones, please, guys. Don't forget watch, in the chat box. The watch mm -hmm. is the... The is watch? On the, table. the watch is on the table. The watch is on the table, okay. Another. Uh, so we have three sentences, guys. Four. Yeah. Continue. The, the umbrella, the is, umbrella? Near, is near the door. Okay. It's near the door. Mm -hmm. um, the, says, uh, the newspaper mm -hmm. is next to the, next to the, como se dice esa cosa, maleta. Oh, the bath, the bath. Yes. Okay. Next yes. to the back. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Okay. I see. Estamos mejor. Okay. Let's see. Vamos a leer los mensajes. It says the cat is on the sofa. Very good, Danilo. Okay. Meredith. Solo tenemos que utilizar the cat, verdad? Sin el it. The, the case. Is... The case. Uh, mm -hmm. The case is next to the cat. The case is next to the cat. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Ok, can be. Ok, Meredith. Tengamos cuidado con esa, Meredith, with your sentence. Yo, yo, self... ya, ah, mano de la, de la mujer. Ah, ok. Pues no. Ok. Ok, thank you, Meredith. Veamos. The watch is above the sofa. The watch. Veamos nuestro watch. Oh, the watch, right, is above the sofa. Oh, en ese caso, watch, que okay, dice es una diferencia, watch es this ones, right? Los que utilizamos en la mano, watch. No. This ones. Si decimos, por ejemplo, reloj de pared, vamos a decir el clock. Clock. Mm. Ok, clock. Tenemos the newspaper, it's on the table, ok. Newspaper, Astrid, but together. Newspaper. Ah, ok. okay. Newspaper. Tenemos the magazine, is behind the chair. Ok, la expresión, Danilo, the expression is behind. No le vamos a agregar to. Behind. Behind the chair. Ok, Danilo. Behind the chair. Ok. Ok, the magazine is under the chair. The cell phone is under the table. Ok, very good, guys. Ok, now ustedes me van a presentar your house, right? Ok, me van a presentar 
todo de su casa, right? Vamos a hacer un recorrido virtual por su casa. No, guys, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Usted va a elegir un lugar de su casa y lo va a dibujar, right? Y ese lugar usted eh, me lo va a describir. You, you can make a drawing, por ejemplo. se puede elegir eh, su mesa, por ejemplo. Your, your table. Y me va a describir lo que tiene in your table, ok. Teacher, lo vamos a dibujar, right. Va a ser una mesa, la va a dibujar. O si quiere tomar una picture, ok, it's ok. Y luego la vamos a describir, right. For example, myself, my table is a mess. Mi mesa es un completo disaster. So, entonces, what do I have in my table? I have my computer. Okay, my computer. My computer is on the table, right? Lo vamos a describir, right? Your, a, a place, un lugar que nosotros tengamos. It can be your bathroom, for example, or something you want to describe. Oh, I have my cell phone too. Next to, next to the computer. Cinco oraciones que estamos bien. Five sentences. Oh, I have a toilet paper. Tengo un toilet paper. The toilet paper is next to my cell phone. And uh, let's see, what do you have? I have a watch. Tengo un watch. Okay, entonces eso es lo que vamos a hacer, right? Vamos a hacer un... Cell phone, I'm sorry, un, un, un objeto, a place, que podamos describir. Ok, les voy a dar unos five minutes, recordemos, vamos a presentar el, el dibujo. Si podemos presentar, sí, vamos a presentar un dibujo o puede ser también una picture. Se lo comparte en WhatsApp y lo puede describir. Ok, uh, about, about a place in your house. Okay. ¿Cuántas oraciones, teacher? Five sentences. Five sentences. Describing. Describing the place. Ok. Eso es lo que vamos a hacer. No questions. Ok. Y les dejo trabajar entonces. I let you work. Let me know if sí, you have questions. Lo, lo mandamos. Sí, en WhatsApp, en WhatsApp. You can be in WhatsApp. Okay. Ok, mientras ustedes presentan, mientras ustedes trabajan, puedo continuar with the presentations, right, that we had for yesterday. Veamos, Astrid ya pasó, César en Silvia, no sé si están ahí. César en Silvia, no, no están. Ok, Guadalupe Juárez, who is your partner? No sé si estamos listos, Guadalupe. Who is your partner? What is your partner? Como teacher. Eh, la tarea de ayer, eh, Guadalupe, no sé si la pre presentamos o su compañero, ¿quién era? No, no teacher, este no, esa sí no la hice yo, teacher. Ok, ok, let's see. Veamos, Arabella, Emanuel, ya están, Danilo, bueno, ya están, pasaron el día de ayer. Meredith, ¿usted pasó el día de ayer? Oh, yes, right, yes, yesterday. Ok, veo que está el de 
Ok, recordemos el mensaje de Lupi que tiene que describir, por ejemplo, the sofa is next to the window, right? Oh, the books are on the shelf. Entonces, tenemos que cambiar ahí las oraciones. Creo que era el de... Está malo, Chica. Sí, en las oraciones están bien, pero estamos utilizando las prepositions of place, right? Entonces, esas son las que tenemos que utilizar. Por ejemplo, the sofa is next to the window. Uh -huh. Ok, solo cambiemos las horas de sentencias, ok, Guadalupe. Ok, solo cinco uh -huh. oraciones, right? Five sentences. I work to uh, I work in the Microsoft Word. Okay, it's okay. No uh, problem. I connect to my computer. No, no, I don't have WhatsApp. Okay, maybe you can well, present uh, here. You can share the screen while you are yes, presenting. Yes, okay, yes. we can do that too. Let's continue.
teacher. Yes, Manuel, tell me. Uh, how do you say in English, espejo? Mirror. Mirror. Um, Mirror. Mirror. Uh, Manuel, you sing, please. What? You can sing. Sim. Yo aguanto todo. Ah, loco. <laughs> <You're> crazy. <laughs> No, hoy sí ando fatal, ando con dolor de cabeza, ando bien cansado. Hoy no me siento bien para andar diciendo así. Ya voy a poner la música. Um, ya la voy a poner. The computer is next to the mirror. What? Tell me. You need you need to listen, to listen to music. <laughs> do you want to do you want to listen I listen to nice wait 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 moment sacar la bocina teacher I finish the the, the Uh -huh. The homework, um, the task? Yes. Okay, so can you present, Danilo, please? I have a pen. I feel sorry. No, I, feel no, I, <laughs> I feel ashamed. I feel ashamed. Uh -huh. uh, because. No sé si está bien, pero igual. Todo sea por apoyar la clase. <laughs> okay, go ahead, continue. Ahí va. It's Friday. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, yeah, amazing bedroom you have. Or amazing living room. I don't know where is it. <laughs> is it your living room or your bedroom? When, when I live in USA. You're gonna have that one. <laughs> okay. Okay, go ahead. The TV is from the sofa. Okay. Mm -hmm. The table next to the chair. My computer is on the table. My PlayStation is next to the lamp. And the TV between the fan and the chair. Ok, Danilo, let's just review some things. Ahí lo, voy, lo deja, no se vaya. Is no correct. Vaya. Ok, I, I'm just going to uh, check some sentences. We have the first one. Recordemos, the first one, the TV is in front. Así es, express, así es el, el, la preposition, right? Is in, in front of, in front of the TV, in front of the sofa. Is in, is it, that is the expression, right? In front of. Tenemos la siguiente, recordemos la estructura. Eh, sujeto, tenemos el sujeto, luego el verbo, en la segunda oración. Is, 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 is. Ok, no nos olvidemos nunca del verbo. The computer is on the table, my PlayStation is next, right? Una letra le hace falta ahí, next. Ah, sí, pero eso es porque... Estoy aquí en, en, no veo el teclado y solo es por la pura memoria que me lo sé. Ok, ok. 
Then we have the PlayStation. It's next to the... Y tenemos el mismo problema en la última oración. The TV is... Is right. Okay. Is. Okay, sorry. Okay, thank you. Let's continue. Thank you. Yes, please. You can okay. stop sharing. Okay. Who continues? Who continues, guys? Who wants to present? Yes, who wants to present? Hola, hola, ¿quién, va? ¿Quién sigue? Who is going to continue, guys? Everybody. Mm -hmm. Me, me, yo. Okay, let's continue. Let's, let's present. Okay. Okay, Arabella. ¿Podemos proyectar? Oh, yes, thank you. Uh, my sofa is... Permítame que esto se me ha puesto aquí. Permítame. Que se me, se me ha puesto algo aquí en la pantalla. Voy a poner el gol. <risa> Ahí tenemos el WhatsApp. Estamos viendo todo su WhatsApp. WhatsApp. Ah, Santo Arabel. Padre Eterno. <risa> <risa> Qué pena, ¿verdad? <risa> aquí está. Es que tengo una como noticia. Que vaya, hoy sí. Vaya, my sofa. Es, no estoy proyectando, no sí, Ahorita sí, Arabela. Ah, ya, sí. ahorita sí, ahorita lo quitó. Sí, estaba okay. proyectando. Sí, sí. Okay. Ya en la noche, ¿verdad? <risa> el sofá es uh -huh. in the living room uh -huh. on the floor. Ya. Yeah. The blanket on the sofa. Uh -huh. My pillow, pillow is in front of uh -huh. the TV. Uh -huh. My computer is behind the table. Ok, vamos a detenernos hasta ahí. No vaya, no vaya a dejar de compartir. Bueno. Arabella, recordemos que en la segunda oración siempre necesitamos un verbo, Ara, eh, Arabella. The blanket is, right? Is. Tenemos the pillow is in front. La expresión es... In front. In front, in front exacto. Esto y no. In front of me. Esa es la expresión. Okay. Sí, eso sí. Okay. My computer is behind. Is behind, but let's with this a form, right? Behind. Okay? Behind. Behind. Oh, Tenemos que cambiar okay. behind. 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 Yeah, behind. Okay, thank you. Solo nos faltó una oración, Arabella. Eran cinco. Ay, es cierto, sí. Puede agregarla en el chat box para que se la bueno. podamos revisar. Okay, thank you. Hoy sí podemos dejar de compartir el WhatsApp. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you, Arabella. Let's continue. Who is going to continue, guys? Who is going to present? Uh -huh. Yes, guys, who is going to present? Yeah, teacher. Okay, continue, uh, Maribel. You can share. Yeah, I'll... Bueno, lo mandé dos veces y la primera se me fue sin haberlo terminado. Ok. Uh, is, ¿Is it the last one? Smile. Sí. Ok, beautiful. You are a neat person, a clean person. ¿Qué persona más ordenada? You are. So beautiful, so beautiful. Ok, I'm going to copy here. Lo voy a copiar acá. Poder compartir. Let's listen Maribel's senses. Okay, go ahead, Maribel. The computer is behind the netbook. Mm -hmm. The netbook is between the pen and the marker. Mm -hmm. The ruler is on the netbook. Mm -hmm. The marker is in front of the mouse. Mm -hmm. the, and the Pen is next to the notebook. Okay, very good. It's only this one that the pronunciation that it is notebook, right? Not notebook. notebook. Okay. Yes. okay, excellent. I'm going to give you a hundred because you are clean, right? <laughs> okay, excellent, Maribel. And uh, let's continue with another person who wants to present, guys. Okay, alguien más? Todavía no hace falta Manuel, Guadalupe, eh, Meredith, too, Oscar, Guadalupe Reyes, and Cesar. Okay? Who is going to present, guys? Okay. 
No, nadie más. Manuel, what about you, Manuel? Yes, yes teacher. Okay, uh, wait, one, one minute, one minute. One minute, too much, too much. Okay, Meredith, what about you, Meredith? Ready? Yes, Meredith. Okay, teacher. <laughs> um, okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher, yes. teacher. Hmm? Okay. Eh, compartí ahí the pictures. Okay. Do you want me to share? ¿Quiere que le comparta? And was... Yes. Okay. Let's see. Ah, okay, okay. Got it. Okay, let's see. Ok, parece que ya podemos verlo. Ok, go ahead. Ok. Eh, is uh -huh. de uh -huh. boutique. <laughs> oh, it's a boutique. Ok. It's a boutique. Ok. Eh, the description. Uh -huh. The child is uh -huh. in front of mirror. Mm -hmm. The mirror is about the desk. Mm, teacher, eh, no es un escritorio, pero mm -hmm. no sé cómo se le llama. Uh, it's above the desk. Está bien. It's yeah, perfect. Yeah, yes. Okay. 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 The mirror is about the desk. Mm -hmm. The eh, electrical. Outlet. No sé si es así. Uh -huh. Este toma corriente. Oh, the charger, maybe the charger. It, the chairman. The charger, charger. The charger uh -huh. in the wall. Is on the wall. Está encima de la it, pared. On the wall. Is on the wall. Is uh -huh. on the wall. The Here, the, mm -hmm. is, eh, no sé cómo decir, pero is uh, about uh -huh. the caja. Box, box. box. Mm -hmm. The box. Mm -hmm. And the, the, the skirt. Are oh, the skirt? To, mm -hmm. Skirt. Mm -hmm. Ne are next to the sock. Okay, the skirts are next to the socks. Okay. It's correct. Yes, the skirts. That's it. Yes. That's it. Yes. Okay. okay. Perfect, Meredith. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Okay, no nos olvidemos el plural, pl plurals, right, Meredith? The skirts. Tenemos que pronunciarla. Okay. Skirts are next to the socks. Okay, okay. Meredith, thank you. Okay. Let's continue with Manuel. Manuel, are you ready, Manuel? Uh, yes, teacher, I'm ready. Okay, go ahead, please. You can present. Yes. Okay, go ahead. The, the closet mm -hmm. is next to the bed. Um, okay, do you have a picture, Manuel? Tenemos una imagen. Do you have a picture? Yes, uh, three pictures. Okay, can you share, please, the pictures? Uh, and in the group of WhatsApp, la can you, oh, Okay, okay. Let's see. Um, the shoes oh, okay, is, okay. Next, is next to the closet. The closet. Mm -hmm. um, the TV is behind of the bedroom. Mm -hmm. The computer is next to the mirror. Mm -hmm. The sofa is near to a to car. Mm -hmm. The sofa is near to car. Okay, solo tengamos cuidado cuando utilicemos los plurales. 
Manuel, the shoes are right. The shoes are. are. Okay, are. No decimos is porque son plurales, right? Don't forget. Okay. okay. El champagne, right? El champagne. <laughs> okay, guys. Champagne. Yes, right. For sure. <laughs> okay, guys, let's continue. And now we're going to watch a video about some of the prepositions. Ustedes van a completar the same picture, right? The same exercise que hemos venido haciendo. Okay, me van a ayudar with this part. Se los comparto en grupo de WhatsApp. Okay, this one. Vamos a escuchar el video y ustedes me van a ayudar that part. Okay, ready? Okay, let's go and watch the video. There it is. Okay, it's 10 o'clock. Yes. And my flight leaves at 12.30. So are you ready? Yes, I am. <laughs> my wallet is in the bag. Good, good. And your ticket? Yes, my ticket. My ticket. Oh no. Ahem. <laughs> my ticket. <laughs> On the TV. Under my notebook. Now you are ready. Yes, now I'm ready. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, oh, your taxi. Bye. Bye. Have fun in Brazil. Yes, thank you. See you in three weeks. Wait. Brazil? Yes, Brazil. Brazil? My passport! Sophia, where's your passport? Maybe it's, maybe it's in a box. Oh, um. Oh. Maybe it's, it's probably behind the chair. Uh, no, it's not here. Okay. Maybe it's next to the sofa. Oh. Sophia, what's this? My camera. Mm -hmm. that. <laughs> my passport! Oh, is that under the box? No. <laughs> oh no! Sophia! Are those your keys in front of the TV? <laughs> yes. Those are my keys. <laughs> Jessica, where's Budapest? Okay, guys, let's complete the exercise so you can help me with this. Okay, let's see the first one. Okay, so at the beginning of the story, it's 10 o'clock. Yes, right. What about the second one? Sophia's flight is at what time? What time? Mm -hmm. Yes. What time, guys? Is it at 12.30 or 2.30? 2.30. 2.30. 
Mm -hmm. It is at? It is two, at 2.30. 2.30, right, 2.30. Sofia's trip is to Peru or Brazil? Brazil. Brazil. Brazil, Sofia yes. Sofia's trip is to Brazil. Yes, Sofia's desk is in the? Bedroom. Living room. Bedroom. Bathroom or living Bedroom. room? Bedroom. Living room. Mm. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Raise your hand if you say bathroom. Raise your hand if you say. You. Tenemos ahí las manitas. Podemos levantar la mano. Is it in the bathroom or in the living room? Okay. Los que digan bedroom, raise your hand. No. Nobody. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay, Maribel says bedroom, in bedroom. the bathroom. Okay, and in the living room, what about in the living room? Who says yeah. in the living room? Oh, only Danilo? Okay, and it is in the bathroom, right? Okay, She's what sick. about Sofia is on a plane to Brazil or Budapest? Budapest, Hungary. Mm, what do you think, guys? Sofia is on a plane to Brazil. Brazil. Brazil, Brazil. right? Brazil. Pero eso fue para Budapest. Yes. <laughs> okay. So, guys, let's move on. And now you're going to work in pairs. You're going to work in pairs. And uh, you're going to complete the conversation, right? Basically, that. Okay. So, let's go to the breakout rooms and complete the conversation so we're going to work in let's see in four okay let's go i'm going to share the information in the chat box link and uh, this is the task Okay, let's go, Arabella and Oscar, Guadalupe and Cesar, what happened? Hello, Arabella. Teacher en tránsito. Ah, okay, 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 Guadalupe. And uh, let's see, Oscar, ¿cómo vamos, Oscar? Yo voy llegando a casa todavía. Okay, okay, let's see. Todavía no estoy en casa, teacher. Okay, en Arabella, ¿cómo vamos, Arabella? Arabella, ah, okay, there it is. Okay, guys, mientras tanto, eh, me indican para poderlos unir a los grupos, okay?
Hello, Manuel and Danilo. Questions? Yes. Eh, yo estoy escuchando el, 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 okay. Okay. el audio, el video en YouTube y, y man, con Manuel lo estamos así haciendo, pero yo solo voy escribiendo lo que hace falta porque no puedo escribir todo por falta de tiempo. Ok, 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 Danilo. Don't worry, we still have some time. Continue. Ok.
Ah, no, 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 no. Me cachó. Te lo caché. La, la caché. Ok, ok, no, but if you listen, por ejemplo, si escuchamos la primera vez, ok, podemos hacerlo, pero yo les recomiendo que eh, al principio está bien porque estamos empezando, pero ya después no, nos vamos a ir acostumbrando a ver los subtítulos y ya no vamos a poner atención a listen. Oh. Okay. ok, no sé si tengan dudas o questions. No, ahorita ya lo oímos como cuatro veces esto, pero no. No, 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 no le llamo, Tiche. Pero okay. ahorita lo que eh, sí entendimos que en la caja, pero yo quería ver en, en la caja sobre o qué, vea. Ok. No la, no la entendía. Aquí. Ok. Está, ah. Estamos, por ejemplo, en la conversation que dice... Sofía, what is your passport? Ajá. Mm -hmm. Ese ya lo vimos. Ok. O sea, la identificamos más bien, sí. pero hasta hace poquito. ¿va? Mm -hmm. Entonces, passport y ya, ya dijimos, este ya lo vimos. Mm -hmm. Ahorita vamos aquí que le dijo, eh, está, so, está en la caja, ¿verdad? Ah, sí. Está ah. dentro de la caja. Ah, pues ese quería ver yo, on o qué. Sería in, recordemos que in es adentro también. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. In. In. Bye. Entonces le voy a quitar esto. Ok, ok. No, como les digo al principio, está bien, pero ya después eh, vamos a ir a acostumbrar. Entonces, eh, poco a poco, right? Ok, sí. poco a poco. Tiene razón, gracias. Ok. Sí, sí. Okay, let's do it together, right? Uh, let's see, vamos a hacerlo juntos, together. Okay, what do you have, Manuel? What do you have in the first one? Sofía, where is your passport? ¿Qué palabra tenemos ahí? ¿Qué palabra, ¿Qué palabra? falta? Ajá, ¿qué palabra? Nos hace falta. Ah, eh, uh -huh. ¿Qué palabra nos hace falta ahí? Where is? No. Uh -huh. ¿Qué palabra no, es? Okay. No, no. ¿Ah? ¿Qué palabra tenemos ahí? Sofía, where is your passport? ¿Qué le responde ah. ella? Uh -huh. What do you have, guys? ¿Qué tenemos ahí? What do you have? Uh -huh. Maybe. Yes, that's right. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe cuando se dice pueda ser, right? Maybe, maybe. También podemos utilizar otra palabra que es lo mismo, que es perhaps. Perhaps tiene el mismo significado. Mm. Okay. Pero la que mencioné el video es maybe. Perhaps es algo extra, right? Una palabra extra. Pero es lo mismo uh -huh. que en in, in, the, in, the, in the box. This in a box, ok. Tenemos in, very good. Let's continue. Oh, maybe it's probably... Behind. It's probably, ok. We have that it is behind, right? Behind yes. the chair. Behind the chair. Behind the chair. Yes, the trash, right? Oh, dice luego ya. Oh. It's not here. <laughs> it's not. It's not it's here. Not okay, here. maybe it's not here. It's not here. Maybe it's in here, guys. What? Maybe it's next. Onto the sofa. Ne next. To. Yes, next that's to. right. Next to. Next to. Sofa. Sofa. To the sofa. Sofa. Okay. Next to the Luego dice Jessica, Sofía le dice. What this? What this? What this? What this or what's this? 
What is this? Muy bien. What's this? What's this? My camera. My camera. Yes, my camera. Y luego dice my my passport. My passport. Is it under? Under. 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 Yes. Is it under? The books? No. 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 Sofia, are those your your right? Your, your keys in front. front TV. In front. front. Oh, front. Front. The expression is in front of. In front, in front of. of. In front of. Yes. Those are my my key. key. My, my keys. keys, my keys, my keys. keys, my keys, my passport. Wait a minute, wait a minute. It's wait on, a minute. The... on desk in the bathroom. The... Desk. It's on the desk, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, very good, guys. Ahí on the la desk respuesta. in the bathroom, people. It's on the desk in the bathroom. In the bathroom. Okay. 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 Aquí está, aquí está. Here you have it. Ok, guys, ya es almost time. It's almost time. Les voy a pedir que vayamos al quiz number 15, número 15. Quiz 15. Yeah. 15, ok. Eh, okay. Recordemos que son palabras que ya estudiamos, right? Les va a aparecer jobs, eh, el verbo to be, for example. Eso ya lo estudiamos también. So let's go. No sé si al principio alguien, digamos, que no haya estado al principio para pasarle asistencia. Veamos, solo reviso lo que estamos. Creo que... Recordemos que estamos en la section 3, right? Okay, tenemos que irnos al last quiz. Number five. Okay, mientras ustedes terminan, yo paso. Just I verify the attendance. Veamos. Cynthia, no. Daniel, Danilo, yes. Gladys. Catherine, no está. Luz, Manuel. Ah, por ahí está Manuel, ¿verdad? Present. Okay, let's see. Meredith, también. Present, teacher. Okay, thank you, Meredith. Yeah, I complete the quiz. Ok, give me just some minutes, porque si no les va a afectar a ustedes en su, eh, okay. en, lo, en los yeah. minutes. That ¿Quién iba a cantar? A oh, no, yes, no. right. Mm, Astrid is not ah. here, she left the ah, class. Está Manuel, Manuel. Oh, es, yes. Es, ¿Yo qué? <laughs> Manuel, stay, bueno. take the night, Manuel. <laughs> take the night, take these minutes. <laughs> El champán del bueno. Ahorita la voy a poner antes de finalizar la clase. Oigan, pues. Sí, es que, ok, está bastante fácil. Veamos. Oye, teacher. No. Oigan, pues, ahí está. Ve. Mire, ya ha preparado el fin de semana usted, ¿verdad? Yo iba a teacher. Sí, sí ya. Sí, mire. Sí, mire. Ya preparándose para el fin de semana. Así es. Para dormir, dormir y dormir. Está bien. Manuel. Okay. Ajá. To write a post online, I must listen to good music. <laughs> ok, guys, solo eh, compartirles algo de información para que ustedes puedan practicar. El libro les da esta ventaja. Ustedes puedan practicar el vocabulario, puedan uh, hacer las preguntas. Entonces, sí, si no hemos revisado el libro, es una muy buena opción para practicar lo que se ve en la clase, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. El lunes. No hay clases, ¿verdad? No, el lunes no vamos a tener clase. Hasta el día martes, ¿ok? Ya solo nos quedarían... ¿Cuántas clases? Five. ¿Five clases? Yes. Sí. 
Oh, yes, right. Okay, yes. Ay, clases, okay. Sí, sí, sí. Okay, entonces sí. Serían eh, las cinco clases a partir del martes. Okay, guys, eh, si ya terminamos, if you finish the quiz, you can leave the class and I hope to see you next Tuesday. Okay, don't forget that. Si alguien que se quiera quedar en review, okay, I'm going to be here. El quiz 15, yes, Manuel, quiz 15. Ahorita no, bye. Goodbye, Daniel. I'll see you. See you. Have Buenas a good noche. night. Gracias a todos. Thank you. Bye, teacher. Bye, Bye Maribel. Santo. Sí, de semana. Disfruten. Coman pupusas y tacos. Yes. <laughs> yes. Thank you. See you. Have a good night, guys. Take care. <laughs> okay. Si hay alguien que se quiera quedar, guys, I'm going to stay here. Um, no sé. Eh, si alguien se va a quedar. Okay. Guadalupe, ¿se va a quedar usted? Bye, teacher. Ah, ok, ok. Estos son 10 minutos eh, si usted se quiere quedar, ¿verdad? Si no, pues... Me, me tocaba el 7, teacher. Vaya, o podemos hacer Pero esto. Si te quiero, me quedo. Podemos hacer esto. Eh, se puede, la podemos mover para este día y ya no la tiene el martes. Vaya, teacher. O si, usted quiere, o si usted quiere que tengamos dos sesiones, pues está bien. Okay, Vaya, ¿cómo? teacher, está si bien. Tienes... Me quedo. Ok, entonces no sé si tengamos alguna duda de algún tema que hemos estudiado. Vaya, teacher. Primeramente, eh, uh -huh. la clase del día de ayer en las, en las direcciones. En la, la, las direcciones, eso sí me cuesta bastante. Para identificar. Los puntos. Los puntos, ok. Ajá. También otra cosa que sí tengo problemas, teacher, uh -huh. Uh -huh. es como cuando están las oraciones desordenadas, a veces ¿Ah? armar las oraciones. Formar las oraciones. Formar las oraciones, ok, ok. Sí, Siempre... es eso. En, en, no sé si el tema sería el simple present. ¿Present? El, simple, el simple, simple present. Ok, ok. Vamos a ver entonces el tema que vimos el día de ayer. Si no me equivoco, veamos, fue acerca de estas prepositions. No sé si son estas, Guadalupe. Sí, teacher. Vaya. Estas tres preposiciones se les llaman las prepositions. Se les llaman las prepositions of time, preposiciones del tiempo. Entonces, estas tienen tres diferentes usos. Bien, por ejemplo, si queremos usar at, at lo vamos a utilizar únicamente. Hola, hola, Guadalupe, está ahí. Hola. Hola, Guadalupe. Hola. Hola, Guadalupe.
Hola Guadalupe, hola. Hola, hola. Creo que el audio, Guadalupe. Ok, ok, no hay problema. Creo que tengo un problema del internet, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, tengo problema ahí. Ok, no problem. Vamos, sigamos entonces. Permítame. Entonces, aquí está. Permítame que se me cambie. Usted. Aquí está. Entonces, estas preposiciones le decía... Tienen tres funciones. Tenemos el in, tenemos el at, tenemos el on. A estas se les conoce también como preposiciones de tiempo. Por ejemplo, cuando usted dice, eh, tengo clases en mayo. Entonces, ese en son esas preposiciones que vamos a ver ahorita. Entonces, el at lo vamos a utilizar cuando sea hora, por ejemplo, a las 2 de la tarde, a las 3, ese vamos a utilizar el at. Okay. Entonces, uh -huh. el at también tiene otras palabras que lo acompañan. Por ejemplo, at night, en la noche, at night. También tenemos, en, cuando decimos en Navidad, ¿verdad? vamos a decir at Christmas. Christmas. Uh -huh. También eh, tenemos, por ejemplo, bueno, más que todo estas, estas tres palabras. Ahora, ¿qué pasa cuando tenemos on? Uh -huh. On. Lo vamos a utilizar cuando tengamos dates, días o fechas. Fechas, dates o días. Por ejemplo, una fecha específica, el cumpleaños, ¿verdad? Sí. Tenemos entonces on January 18, cuando decimos uh -huh. el 18 de junio. Es una fecha específica. Entonces vamos sí. a utilizar on. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eh, por ejemplo, cuando decimos on Saturday evenings. Uh -huh. En los eh, sábados por la tarde. En otro ejemplo, on Christmas Day que lo vamos a utilizar con on, on Christmas Day, el día de uh -huh. Navidad. Ok, no sé si hay dudas con at y con on. No. Ok, pero ¿qué pasa si tenemos in? In lo vamos a utilizar con, por ejemplo, las siguientes expresiones. Cuando estamos hablando del futuro. Por ejemplo, en unos minutos, para decir en unos minutos, vamos a decir in a few minutes. Uh -huh. Para in decir a few. in a few minutes. Para decir, por ejemplo, en, en algunos meses. En algunos uh -huh. meses sería in some months. Entonces vamos a utilizar in. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. También lo vamos a utilizar con los años. Por ejemplo, en 1960. Ahí vamos a utilizar in. Uh -huh. Para un mes también lo vamos a utilizar, pero no especificamos como una fecha. Solo decimos el mes. Por ejemplo, en abril, en mayo, vamos a utilizar in. In abril. In. Ajá. Por ejemplo, en abril. In April. Bien, esas son las prepositions of time. Me preguntaba acerca de, me preguntaba acerca de, de las direcciones, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo identificar? Creo que fue, veamos, en esta parte, esta parte. Para identificar. Ahí, perdón. Ahí sí me perdí totalmente, le digo. Vaya. Entonces, aquí básicamente lo que decimos es el banco está a la par de la zapatería. Entonces, ayer estuvimos viendo eso. Entonces, sí. se van a utilizar estas expresiones. Por ejemplo, on, 
ese, ese on lo vamos a utilizar, por ejemplo, cuando decimos sobre la avenida Independencia, sobre la cuarta calle. Entonces, vamos a utilizar on. Ahora, vamos uh -huh. a utilizar on the corner of, en la esquina de, de la calle principal y la primera avenida. Uh -huh. También tenemos otra expresión que es, otra preposición que es across from. Across from es al cruce de un lugar a otro. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Luego tenemos next to. Next to lo vamos a utilizar para decir a la par de un lugar. Next to. Uh -huh. Ok. Y luego tenemos la palabra between, que between lo vamos a utilizar en medio de dos lugares. Entonces, si yo le pregunto, si yo le pregunto, por ejemplo, ¿dónde está el banco? Where is the bank? ¿Cómo me responde usted? Vamos a ver. Ok, la pregunta es, where is the bank? El banco está entre el lofty department y el, no, no alcanzo a ver acá. Quiero ver si me poner en. Ah, Ajá, ¿cómo nos quedaría? The bank. The bank next to. Ok. Next to. Mm. Okay. Y decimos el nombre del lugar, vea. Sí. Next to. The part, the par, department. Department store, right? Uh -huh. Ok, pero acá nos hace falta algo. Acá nos hace falta algo. Voy a escribir acá. The bank next to the department. Vaya. Acá nos hace falta algo y es el verbo. Porque si yo lo traduzco eso, voy a decir el banco a la parte del department store. Nosotros lo vamos a nosotros lo vamos a, a entender bien, ¿verdad? Pero en inglés siempre se sigue un patrón. Que es el sujeto, el verbo. En este caso, ¿cuál sería el verbo, Guadalupe? The bank is, right? Is next to the department store. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Por lo demás, está bastante bien la oración. Sí. Ok, lo que podemos hacer, Guadalupe, le puedo compartir unos videos para que usted pueda repasar lo que vimos el día de ayer. Vaya, Pero estamos bastante bien, bastante bien, vamos bastante bien, Guadalupe. Ok, se lo comparto entonces por WhatsApp para que usted lo pueda ver. Ok, Está bien, teacher. okay Guadalupe, la dejo descansar entonces y nos vemos hasta el martes, ok. Bien, teacher. Bye. Okay. Gracias, Oiga. Nos vemos. Buenas noches. De nada. See you. See you, teacher.